Get pasa everybody, so this video I'm gonna make a series on how to put a motor together. So So as you can see I already took it apart. Alright. And this motor is for my boat. It's a 1987 Malibu that I just got a couple months ago. And that's the old motor right there. And when I got it, uh, the guy said that this motor had water in the oil. He had the head rebuilt, and it still had more water in the oil. So I don't know if it's a crack block, the crack head, if they didn't expect the head right or whatever. I don't know. But I'm going to build this motor right here. And uh, with this one, I'm going to do step by step. I'm going to make a video on how to put the crank on, honing, pistons, every little thing. Everything's going to be new. I'm going to get new pistons for it. Cam. And it's going to be a budget build. And by budget, I mean budget. I'm going to buy try and buy the cheapest, but not cheapest parts to make it uh, work. So. Can you see those? So this is a 350 4 bolt main. Here's that number right there. Look at the bottom. Ah, uh, can you see it? Maybe? No. Uh, I don't know. Well, this is a 350 4 bolt main. And, uh, yeah, today I am going to uh, hone it and clean it up. Get it ready to install the crank. And I'm going to show you guys how to do all that, too. So just uh, keep watching. Follow the series that I'm going to do for you guys. All right. Let me get ready. Clean all this up real quick. All right, so here we go. I'm a hone. This one do not. This is what I'm using right here. You can buy this at uh, any parts store or Harbor Freight. So. And WD There's that. I'll show you guys real quick. Right way. So here's what. Did, can you see it? Oh, messed up. Kind of surface rust. And then. Gotta go a little more. But look at that. Well, gotta go more. But yeah. So I'm gonna keep going and uh, I'll get back to you guys real quick. All right. So as you can see, I've been using this one plenty of times. Look at that. See that? It's almost done. Uneven. So before I keep going, I'm going to just go buy a new one. And, uh, broken. And that happens when you go too far in and you smack the side of the block on the inside. So, I'm going to go buy a new one and I'll come back to you guys. Okay, me Alright, so I just got back from the store, or Hover Freight, when I got a new one. And this was right there, 22 bucks, 22.99. I also bought a shop press, so I can press out the, the old uh, pistons because I'm going to install new pistons on it. Alright, so I'm going to open it up and 
keep going at it. All right, so I just got done with the first pass. You can see already that thing looks clean. Needs a little bit more, but other than that, looks good. This one looks good. This one, that's from uh, just sitting in water accumulating or something. But a uh, little bit more on that one. And this one has a little bit right there, but maybe one or two more passes, it should be good. But compared to this side, no, 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 no. way better. Yeah. So, keep going at it. Alright, so now we're going to do the other side. All right, so I started doing the other side. Uh -huh. Watch. Where's it at? Right there. It's done. It's flat. Can you guys see it? So you can see that one has a lot of, not a lot, but a good amount. This one is completely flat. Completely flat. This one's still good. This one's still good. And this is the new one. So don't get this one. You fill it up already? Leave it, pues ya que, ni pedo. So this is the old one I've been using. That one's still fat. Just cracked. I mean, it still works. This one has a little bit left. That one's fat. So, I'm going to use the old one. Finish it off. Alright. So, now let's clean it up. Get a rag. That's it. Check it out. Clean. This one I gotta go a little more. All of them, the rest, look good. Look at that. So yeah, flip it over for you guys. That's just oil. But that's it. 
that's how you hone the block just go fast 20 30 seconds go to the other one 20 30 seconds do that all around I like to do about two passes clean them out that way it's all nice and clean so yeah stay tuned next video uh, well I'm gonna go send it out to uh, one of my buddies he knows how to install these cuz where's it at um, there. See that? that's where the, the bearings connect and it's already showing so I'm gonna take it into uh get those replaced I don't do those uh -uh. but I'm not gonna record that part but the next video is me installing the crank and then after that getting uh installing the pistons so yeah there's gonna be a series right here so you can build your own block pretty much all right thanks for watching come back like share subscribe let me know what you think